in the sum length is 50 height is 30 and width is 30 so first we will draw layout we will mark 50 on the right hand side 30 and 30 on this side draw vertical line and we will draw parallel line at 30 30 degree so first we will draw layout after layout when you see front view see in this front view there are two surfaces one and two there is a dark line in between that means this one and two we can't draw it directly over here that means if I can draw one I can't draw two over here if I draw two I can't draw one over here so we need to decide which one is nearer to me or which one is nearer to observer now if you see this part one in top view this part one is here and in, top, in part two is here so of course if you see from this side this part one is nearer to the observer so first we will draw part one that is 50 by 10 so we will draw 50 by 10 after drawing this part if you see top view how much it is going behind to draw part two see this is part one what we have drawn now part two so how much I have to go behind this is 30 minus 10 so how much would be this 20 so go behind by 20 from here you go behind by 20 to reach to this point if you see the main diagram this point in front view this point now I can draw this block of 20 by 20 so from here I will go up 20 20 20 20 so this what I have done is part 2 now if you see part 2 in top view that given with 10 see it's 10 behind 10 behind so what I can do in main diagram I will go 10 10 behind and I will join those same way in isometric whatever is there in the front the same thing is behind so this part is behind you have to go behind by 10 you are also go behind by 10 and draw this line and then you have to complete the object if you see the top view you will come to know this part so that I can extend from here and here and then I can dampen it so now if you see the main diagram see there are two part part 1 and part 2 so this is your part 1 this is your part 2 and if you observe there is a dark line so that is this line now how much it is behind that we came to know from top view from front view you can't make out how much it is behind because in front view we can't see width right we, we came to know that it is behind by 20 from here if you see the main diagram see this part this is 20 it's going behind so we, we went behind and then we have drawn part 2 and afterwards this part the main diagram is this part so this and this again there are two different levels 